welcome to my channel if you are new here hello you are spiritually connected with katiba that's for sure okay look the weapons formed against you failed tremendously they failed tremendously there were so many odds against you when it comes to who you are the odds were betted against you where you come from the odds were against you your story was never supposed to turn out in the ways in which it did i mean clearly it was supposed to turn out that way because it's destined it's pre-written but just the the cycles that have been continued just like where you come from who you are nah you wasn't supposed to make it this far you wasn't supposed to like everything was against you the odds were against you yet you conquered anyway the weapons formed against you failed tremendously there were people who were literally trying to physically <laughs> throw weapons against you yet you were like you were slick with it you were dodging them you took them as they came you didn't fold, you didn't crumble, you didn't like, you didn't melt. You were tough enough to handle everything that came your way. Every person that tried to sabotage you. Every situation that tried to bring you down. Every time when somebody tried to hurt you. Any time where you tried to hurt yourself. Whether that was physically, mentally, emotionally your thoughts, your vices, things that could have took you like on a whole, it could have took you to a whole new life. For some, you could have be, you could be like deep into drug addictions and maybe you once was. Maybe you could have been deep into alcoholism or deep into other things. <laughs> that were meant to destroy you, yet you made it out of that. Yet you was able to downgrade. Yet you no longer need those things that you thought you once needed to survive. Yet you no longer need those things to escape life. Yet you able to control yourself. Every weapon that was formed against you failed tremendously. You were supposed to be like, like when people look at your life and where you came from, you were never supposed to be where you are today. The things that people have done to you, you were never supposed to make it out of that. You were supposed to be deep within that. You were supposed to stay deep within that. You were supposed to be hurt. There were people who tried to hurt you physically, mentally, emotionally. And it failed tremendously. Those things, those very things that others had put out for you, it got returned to sender. It got returned to the sender. Rather that's somebody else, or if it was just your lower self. Leave your lower self where it's at. You left your lower self behind. Your mindset is totally different from what it was three years ago, a year ago, even three months ago. The weapons that were formed against you, they did not make it. They did not last. They have perished. They are perishing. The odds were totally against you. You wasn't supposed to be who you are. Never. <laughs> Ever. Like, you, out of all people, having the story that you had, being the person that you once were, nah. You wasn't supposed to make it out of that. Not only were the odds against you, there were people betting against you. And there are still people betting against you. 
waiting for you to fall off, patiently waiting for you to fall off, patiently waiting for you to become that person again. There are some people who believe that they know exactly who you are based off of who you used to be, based off of the ways that you used to move. You're not that person anymore. That life has come and gone for you. You had to experience it. Okay, so be it. You learned your lessons. You learned many lessons within that. And you may not regret none of it. It has made you to the person that you are today. And you know that you that's one thing that you won't go back to. You've hit rock bottom. You was never supposed to make it to the top. Now you're climbing up that ladder and people are confused, quite honestly. <laughs> you may be even confused. Like, wow, I can't believe that I've <laughs> I switched it up. Like I hit them with that switch up. You hit them with that switch up. <laughs> you hit yourself with that switch up. And when you was deep into that, when you were deep into who you were, you never seen this coming. The person who you are today, you you only once maybe dreamed about it, or maybe you haven't even hadn't even thought about it way back when. Way back when can be two weeks ago. Be proud of yourself, first and foremost. <laughs> Be proud of yourself. But you didn't do it alone. But I think you know that. God was with you every step of the way. Even when you didn't think so. Even when you didn't believe. Even when you didn't have the confidence. Now your confidence is... Your confidence is skyrocketing. No one expected you to be as confident as you are today. No one expected you... To be who you are today. Considering who you used to be. Considering who you used to hang around. Considering the type of things that you were deeply embedded into. No one seen it coming. No one seen it coming. The odds were against you. There were so many weapons formed against you. They were literally thrown. And they bounced back. They bounce back up off of you. As your light continues to shine, as you become uh, continue to become more awakened, there's nothing that can destroy you. The weapons were sent to destroy you. There were some people who literally wanted to destroy you because you were not speaking their language. They may have literally like, tried to throw weapons at you. You may have had a near-death experience. You may have went through some real bad term oil in your life. But none of that took you out of here. You are still here. You may have destroyed yourself mentally. Yet every day you get up and you're able to elevate your mindset. You're able to still speak positivity to yourself through it all. You're able to still fight your battles, to fight your demons within. Despite anything that may be going wrong, those weapons, your lower self, Has nothing on your higher self. Has nothing on you, who you are. Has nothing on who you are as a soul, not as this human being. It's a constant battle between your soul and your mind. And your soul is kicking your mind's butt. Your soul is kicking your ego down. <laughs> your soul is stomping your ego out. And it may hurt because you feel it. Because we're very attached to this right here. We're very attached to this this, this meat. <laughs> we're very attached to this avatar. Weapons are formed against your avatar. But they have failed tremendously. They're continuing to fail. Not much is really working out. You may get set back two steps. But then you take three steps, four steps, five steps forward. 
life is gonna happen life be life and we all know that but you don't let that stop you you don't let that stop you before you may have and for many they remember that person they remember that person they can't understand how you was able to pull yourself up out of that you pulled yourself up out of that you had you were reaching out your arm and you had god like pulling with you like you had that that energetic field pulling you up as you were trying to maneuver through like quicksand like you was it, it was like you were maneuvering through quicksand don't nobody make it out of quicksand how sway <laughs> how how did you do it you have people wondering how did you do it how did you fight those battles not knowing that you didn't fight alone you didn't fight alone you show your gratitude you had god right there on your side cheering you on when you couldn't even cheer yourself on you had God right there putting people in positions to leave you alone. <laughs> putting people in positions to leave you alone because they see that everything that they do is not working. It's not phasing you, even though it might phase you. Even though it may phase you a little bit. You don't give people the pleasure. You don't give people the power over you. You don't even give your physical self the power over your spiritual self. So if this video resonates, if it hit different, let me know how so. If you are new here, I do invite you to hit that subscribe button. That is all I have for this video stay spiritually you stay spiritually in tune and i cannot believe hold up that i did not say um if you ain't got your charm already because i have a hundred dollars waiting on you so you must click the link in my description sign up with shine with your direct deposit and you'll have a hundred dollars coming your way like who don't want an extra hundred dollars you got people out here fighting for to get a raise to to get a a, a twenty thirty dollar bonus. Like <laughs> that's all I have for this video. Stay spiritually used. Stay spiritually in tune, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.